Hey guys, it's Angel, and you might think it's my birthday going by my nails because I look like I have a funfetti cake on them, but it's not. This adorable little pot is Nail Fetti from Twinkle Tea, and it consists of two different sizes of neon dots in six different colors. At least I think it's six different colors. I kept trying to count them, but then I realized I was just counting the same colors over and over again, so let's go with six. And they are super easy to use, so let's get started. For my base, I use Super Chic Lacquer Bring It On Base Coat. And then for three of the nails, I applied OPI Alpine Snow because I just knew that those neon dots were really going to pop over a white base. And for the other two nails, I used China Glaze Fresh Princess because I thought this looked like pink frosting and it went with the whole funfetti nail fetti birthday cake theme. And I don't know about you, but when something is covered in pink frosting, it's immediately in my belly. Then I applied another coat of OPI Alpine Snow and while the polish is still wet, so you gotta kinda be a little quick with this, I grabbed my mini orange stick that I had wet the end of and I was going to use that to help me pick up the neon dots and place them. For me, I find using a moist orange stick, <laughs> that's a gross way of saying that, is the best way to apply glitter like this nail fatty, although it's not really glitter, is it? I don't know. Applying these dots like nail fatty or even little mini jewel studs is the best way for me. So this was actually the second time that I filmed this nail. I took it off the first time because it looked like crap. And I just kind of went in all willy nilly without a dot placement plan as I'm gonna call it. And it just looked disheveled and not right. So I took a step back, I removed it, and then I thought about what I wanted to do. And I realized that I kind of wanted it to look more like a gradient. So I bunched them up more towards the cuticle and then made sure to spread them out as I went down the nail. I mean, there really is no wrong way to do it. You can make it more like a symmetrical polka dot pattern, or you could do maybe all one color, or just add a couple at like the cuticle, almost like they were nail studs. You probably could even just sprinkle them onto the wet polish, but that's not something that I would do because I would feel like you might, they might just layer up and bunch up on each other and might be thick in some parts and, you know, have uneven coverage and then you can't really move them around once they're on the wet polish. So I preferred placing them this way and it honestly really didn't take long. It probably only took me like, I don't know, maybe a minute a nail. And even though it doesn't take very long to place the dots, I would recommend trying to use a slower drying polish because if you use one that's quick drying, the surface of the nail may not stay tacky enough for the dots to stick to. And the wetter the polish, it seems like the more the dots kind of sink in and stay a little more flush to the nail. So you can use less coats of top coat that way. And then once I was happy with my dot placement plan, I did a little cleanup with my favorite cleanup brush. This is the number six brush from Twinkle Tea. Then I added my top coat. Here I'm using Super Chic Lacquer Liquid Macro Top Coat and I did end up using two coats of top coat because I felt like after the first one you could still feel a little texture on the nail which which isn't really that big of a deal. I know that doesn't bother some people but I really wanted these to be more glossy so I went with two. And that completes my super easy fun fetti birthday cake nails. And disappointingly, nail fetti is not actually sprinkles, so they're not edible. I was extremely disappointed to find this out. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. And I really hope somebody watching this that it is actually their birthday because happy birthday, I made these nails just for you. And don't forget, you can follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter at twy underscore star. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Uh, bye bye